Can't say I blame you. Ah, uh, I wish. Fake fluffy rubs and the storm service all by myself. How you doing? You okay? Not really. I was hoping you might have a minute. Absolutely. It's kind of personal. Okay. Let's have a sandwich. Going on. There's really no easy way to say this, so I'm just going to ask you straight up. When you were with my dad, did he ever beat you? Diane told me yesterday was pretty crazy in court. Dad went off again. At least it was on Johnny and not some defenseless woman. Your dad didn't know that you were there. See, I don't understand. Why is that an excuse? If dad only acts normal when he knows his kids are around, then it's still an act, right? The angry, yelling guy is still inside waiting to get out. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm so bothered by it. I mean, it's not like I've never seen my dad lose control before. I can understand why this is confusing. And scary. Dad was awful to Claudia the night she died. But I mean, I guess if you can twist your brain around, you can sort of justify it. I mean, she did get Michael shot. I'm not saying she deserved to die, but he just found out. So of course he'd be furious. But you're different. I mean, Dad married you a bunch of times because he loved you. But if he also abused you too, then it would be a lot harder to justify the way he treated Claudia. Sunny and I had a crazy, volatile relationship. We loved hard and we fought hard. Sunny was emotionally and sometimes verbally abusive. But so was I. One thing off the table, and, and that's if there's anything you take away from my involvement with Sunny, it's what to avoid in a relationship. Not that I regret being with Sunny, I don't, because a, a lot of good came from us. But I didn't know how to be healthy when we got together. I mean, I was angry, I was needy, I was insecure. I thought that negative attention was better than no attention at all, and I'm grateful every day that that's not my mindset anymore. So are we clear on that? Yes. Okay. Christina, you're... Sonny didn't know any more or better than me how to be in a functional relationship. We would push each other's buttons till one of us exploded. And then it was on. I mean, we were yelling, screaming, throwing things at each other, calling each other names. And I gave as good as I got. I mean, I would provoke just to get a reaction. That was my sickness. But with all that, not once did Sonny raise a hand to me. And yes, yes, his temper can be fearsome. And I'm sorry that you had to see that. But what you saw in court were two men having a confrontation, and from what I understand, instigated by the prosecutor. But what about Claudia? I mean, Dad was brutal to her that night. Your father had just found out that Claudia cost Michael a year of his life. She lied to him every day they were married. Did you see your father hit her? No. No. He's not perfect, Christina. But he's not a batterer. He doesn't have it in him. Well, as you know. No. But I'm curious. Did you want to see me because you're my brother or because you're a cop? Yeah, you know, sometimes it's hard for me to make the separation, but right now, as your brother. I'm just disgusted by what happened to you, and I want to make sure I can do anything to help you. As a cop, I want to make sure the jerk who did this doesn't get away with it and has to pay for it. I'm good with how it worked out. It's what I wanted. The charges against Ethan have been dropped, and it's over. And don't be so sure of that. What do you mean? Look, uh, I've worked a lot of domestic violence cases, and it's like a pattern of escalation without any intervention I mean your abuser is going to abuse you again only it'll be worse 
whether it happens to you or someone else. He's really sorry. Horrified, actually. I don't even think he'll get in another fight with a guy. You seem convinced. People do things that they regret afterwards. Don't you believe that people can learn from their mistakes and never do it again? Yeah, yeah sure, in a perfect world, but this is anything but. Do you think Dad's seriously sorry for shooting you? Yeah, you know, I don't know what to believe about that. You don't really like him, do you? Sure, what makes you say that? It's like a veil goes down over your eyes when anyone mentions Dad. I can relate. Mostly, I hate him. But he's your father, so you can't help but wanting to love him. That's it, exactly. Talking to a cop? He's my brother. Is this about the beating? Why, you, uh, you know something about it? 